Webner CTV with Danny Cashman following a 4-2 win over Talker United. Two goals for you today, Danny. A fantastic performance. Yeah, um, I think first half we were really good. I think that's probably one of the best performances we've had first half. I think we was a real threat going forward. Um, they only seemed to kind of hurt us really when it was a dead ball situation. We kind of switched off, but I think first half we were we were really good. I think we put them under a lot of pressure and their keeper. Um, and then coming out at half time, I think we came out second half a bit a bit slow and a bit sloppy, kind of not sticking to what we believe in. Um, and then just good to get the three points, really, you know, keep ourselves up there and, and pushing on. Talk us through the two goals. That second one in particular, the finish was fantastic. Uh, talk us through what was going on with both of them. Um, I mean, the first one, obviously, I just I saw Ruben get it out of his feet and I knew he was going to shoot. I just thought, you know, I had one on, the, on Tuesday night where I didn't follow in and I was. A bit gutted on that, so I just thought I was gonna run in and, and see what happens. And luckily, I just got a poach on it. And then the second goal, it just fell to me, and I heard Ollie screaming at me. And I just thought, Do you know what, I'm just gonna see what happens there. And luckily, it just kind of bent round him and and went in, and just kind of looked towards the away fans. Just a bit of a bit of fun, really. You know, I heard them giving a bit a bit of stick, so it was just uh, quite nice to quiet them off a bit. Uh, good to ignore Ollie as well. Yeah, I mean, if I missed, he was going to be screaming at me for God knows how long, but luckily it went in and uh, he hasn't moaned at me yet, anyway. We've been chatting a little bit with Ollie recently about the partnership you guys have formed, uh, that forward line. How are you, from your perspective, how are you finding everything? It seems like you guys are really clicking. Yeah, I mean, obviously when I was first here a few years ago, me and him linked up really well, so I knew that we were going to be on the same kind of wavelength. Obviously, he's a... He's a goal scorer, do you know what I mean? He, he will always score goals, that's just what Oli does, and he's arguably the best striker in the league, and that's, you know, his, his stats speak for himself, not just the, this year, but since being at Worthing. Um, so, you know, once it's going to come to him, he's going to put it away eventually. Uh, he, don't, he doesn't need more than, uh, more than two chances. So, I think we, we know what each other likes doing and what we're, we're good at and what our weaknesses are, and, um, you know, we probably had a bit of stick at the start of the season for taking our time to gel, but, you know, things take time, and I think as a team, it's taken us a bit of time to, to come together to understand what each player likes. And you can see that now, I think with the performances, we, we're dominating, dominating every week and, and most importantly, we're getting the results. Yeah, how are you finding it, uh, coming in a little bit into the season for you, coming in in September, how have you found gelling into the squad? Do you feel like you're fully adjusted now? Yeah, I think, you know, the main thing for me was to be happy again. I think once I'm happy, that's when I play my best football. and. Coming at the start, I think it was more about getting fit rather than worrying about performances and, and goals, which was obviously frustrating me at the start because it took me a while to, to get my first goal and ultimately I, I want to score as many goals as I can and, and get assists and help the team. But I feel like now I'm kind of confident again that I can trust my ability and I love the way that we play. You know, the manager likes me, hopefully, anyway. So. You know, it seems to be going well, and hopefully, I mean, I just want to get, I just want to do as well as I can with this club, and you know, push on to to whatever that may be. I want to help this club get to to where it should be. With your two goals today, eight goals for the season so far. Ten now, actually. Oh, it's including now. the cup. Ten. Yeah, ten including the cup, but eight in the league. So, um, yeah, I just want to try and get as many as I can. You know, help the team out. You know, I want to be a bit more selfish in terms in front of goal and. You know, everyone likes scoring. It, it gets your name out there again as well. And at the end of the day, if if it helps the team push on, you know, like I mean, even today, I think I was one on one and, and I just squared it to Dill because I just thought, you know, it's just a, I just want to help the team. You know, what I mean, that, that that's what I've kind of learned to get to grips with, kind of being more of a team player, and and the individual stuff will, will come along with it.